everyone. My name is the Party Hat Terror Brain with a beautiful face. See, my webcam appeared once I said beautiful face. And it'll disappear when I say ugly face. Wait, and why did it appear? Now I did. Beautiful face. Okay. And a shout out. I know I said I'd do this in the second video. But it turns out someone actually did guess it. Uh, uh, Bilbo Baggins and the Shire. Bilbo Baggins is a hobbit from the Shire, and the Shire is in uh, the Middle Earth. I did some stuff off camera. I mean, a lot of stuff. I had a lot of spare time, and my internet was down, so all I did was this. Yeah, while I was building something, the angler came. Bumblebee tuna. This is how you get it. You fish in the... I think you fish in there. And let me see this. Oh yeah, and off camera, I built this huge long platform out of asphalt. You didn't see anything. And I also made uh, this thing called a, where is it? A min mega shark. Uh, I meant to show it on camera. But I wanted to test to see if I could actually do it in a fashionable time. Uh, okay. So this is basically how you make. Wait. Do it. Where is he? Oh. <laughs> I'm blind. I don't want to be blind. Basic. Wrong person. You basically buy a mini shark, which is 35 gold. I know. Hmm? And then you uh, get five shark fins from the ocean. Then you. Let me remember how to do this. And then uh, at nighttime, buy from this dude. Uh, I forget what they're called, but they're yellow. And I think they're illegal. Oh, they're illegal gun parts. And I reef. And like I literally, this was a broken razor blade typhoon. I clicked the reforge button with this thing in it, and I got mythical first try. And another pirate invasion spawn. Wanna well, know what I got? I got a bait. I got a pirate. I also made this off camera because I needed it. I'm gonna, guys, just because I want you guys to have it because I'm gonna try to make a world download for you guys. Uh, I think I'll make you got all because if you guys. Cause, oh yeah, and I also may have that. Cause I had to make accessories that won't give me the debuff of a mana flower. But I also need tons of mana stuff. Uh, okay. Oh uh, yeah, and off camera I had a, there was a dynasty wood thingy. Oh yeah, and before we do that though, guys, uh, I got, I fought the twins and a bunch of destroyers, so we're gonna need to make this pickaxe axe, but don't worry, we're gonna fight the twins, don't worry, we're gonna fight the twins, though, we're gonna fight the twins though, so don't tell me that I'm cheating. And I don't know if I should make these or not. Nah, I'm not gonna make it. Okay, I need 
I wonder where my... Okay, I don't know where my... There we go. If you guys want to have this weapon, I think you right click it and then it'll change your weapon with that. See? And uh, now we will change the number. It's not three anymore, guys, because we're lucky again. Quick stack. Now we have 124 subs. Whoa! See the pirates dancing. And you're wondering what this is. I bought it from the traveling merchant also. And now, we need to make celestial cuffs. And right now, I'm trading that out. Because basically, when I'm using magic like this, <clears throat> first of all, if it drops any uh, mana, <clears throat> first of all, if it drops any uh, mana stuff, if it drops any mana stars, basically, uh, it'll pull the mana stars toward me, and plus, if I get damaged, I also get mana. Okay, first of all, in the fighting the twins, we could just use this, because I fought the, I bought the Duke Fish Run nicely, I fought it with, uh, crystal bullets, from the, this. Okay, first of all, we're gonna be going to the. First of all, when spawning the twins, you need three of these. Hold on, I have a bunch of stuff in my inventory I don't need. Oh yeah, and there was also a, a solar eclipse. All the good things hop head off camera, don't they? I got this. And four of these. This was the luckiest thing ever. Basically, I grappled to this. I put this up here, these up here. And I sh well pretend this razor blade typhoon is a laser, is the godly laser rifle. Basically, I had a shot down the whole time. And I got so much stuff, and I was getting, since I used a heart reach potion, I got so much health from this. The vampires that flew up here, they couldn't even, they couldn't even defeat me. So they just fall to the bottom. Well, you're probably wondering what we're gonna do with that. First of all, I'm taking this. Okay, and now we'll put all the gold furniture in here. Okay, and now we will go home. And you guys are probably wondering, what do we do with those broken hero swords, you say? Well, it goes something like this. You make a true knight's edge, which does 100 damage. You make a true excalibur, which does 77 damage. And then, basically, you add a broken hero sword to both to the Knight's Edge and the Excalibur. And then you need one more broken hero sword to make the best sword in the game. Bye.
Boom! You guys like me now? You guys like me now? It's only like the 12th episode. We got a terribly. Plus, guys, I know this is a fast playthrough, but I'm... There's basically... Let's go to the chart. 1.3. Basically, the bunny says... 1.3 in 5 days. Yes. Because they said 1.3 is going to come out on June 30th, which is in 5 days for me. And anyone uh, in Australia, I think... Australia or Japan, I think, is uh, right now in 4 days for them. Basically, Angler lives there. Now, let me show you guys what I have did most. Because I built this thing over here for a pirate. Now I know there's a little water, but you can't get rid of it. A pirate lives there. Also, I need to get inside that. Yes, yeah, so I'm gonna be doing some other stuff off camera. Three platinum and 75 gold. I just summoned the pet ferret. Okay, so you guys want to see what I? Okay, hold on. I may do this. What should I switch this out for? I'll switch that out for that. Wait, this does... This does 12 and that... Okay, so... It's good. We're gonna be using this. Oh, yeah. And I made a truffle worm farm and I got seven truffle worms, so... We're hooked up on truffle worms. So, basically, you do that. And when it bobs down... not hard especially when he's in the beginning stages so basically I did the same thing but with the only I aimed with the, with the mega shark and I basically did this guys I don't even think we'll need to do use anything but palladium armor because this armor is just so OP guys plus these asphalt blocks are OP once he gets on like 30, once he gets to 2,500 health, wait, yeah, 25, no, once he gets 25,000, once he gets to 25,000 health, uh, he switches to his second form. And, uh, he's gonna change, uh, now. As I said, he's gonna change now. And you, as you see, he does a ton of damage. You do a ton of damage to him. Well, if you have a high DPS weapon like the Mega Shark, you do. Even the Mini Shark. Even though the Mini Shark takes a long time to to use, and also the Laser Rifle. Laser Rifle's same thing as same distance. Five thousand health. Okay, shoot, shoot. Dishrishan has been defeated.
Tsunami! We just got the best bow in the game. Boom! Put that there and uh, how far we go? Okay. With the Mega Shark, you need to go back. You need to go all the way there and you need to go all the way back. But with this. Uh, actually, before we do anything, uh, we're gonna go defeat the twins. I'll be back in a split sec. Okay, guys, I am back, and I've made a bunch of these. So basically, you want to aim at Spats in this first. He's gonna do uh, most of the damage with that debuff he gives. You guys saw me defeat Spatsonism yesterday. I mean, in the last video. But I didn't have enough time to defeat the Retinizer. Uh, that's them defeated, I think. Yes, a Retinizer trophy. Where's my mouse? Oh. Whoops. Okay, I got a little too cocky there. Wait, were they defeated? No. Sorry guys, I got a little too cocky there. Everyone gets a little too cocky sometimes. Okay, heal. I know what I am gonna do though. I can do that and do buffs. Cause I forgot I'm using Polydium armor and I can't get too cocky. defeat the twins guys and now to fight Skeletron Prime basically a Skeletron Prime you can just you basically just need to dodge everything. He's a lot easier to dodge than the twins, who, the, who are way faster than you. You. This thing just shreds his arms. I mean, with all these things, I I wish this thing didn't wasn't you didn't you didn't have to I wish this thing you had to aim with. This, then it would be so much easier. I mean, I wish you didn't have to aim with him. I wish you didn't have to aim with this Ridgeway Typhoon. It's just too OP. I know people who are. I know people are saying, well, you're the, you're actually really, okay, I ran out of mana, so. Hmm, I thought I had more mana than this. Oh yeah, and also after you defeat all the mechanical bosses, it says in green text, it says the jungle grows restless. Yes, we got the 
trophy, the trophy, which is all I was asking for. Okay, and now we make a mannequin. Right there. And now we place that right there. And that right there. Right there. And then we place... What? No, I meant to... Bow! Let's see how many masks we have. We have the hard, the getting the hard mode boss. We have the starting the game boss. We have the we have the we have the hardest boss of the mechanical bosses, and we have the easiest boss of the mechanical bosses. Think we did pretty good. And when it becomes daytime, uh. Well, let's fight the twins one more time. Just cause we can. See how much damage this thing does? It doesn't do as much damage against the, ty the, ty the Razor Blade Typhoon cause the uh, twins move a lot. But this, this is just an amazing weapon. I used to think it doesn't didn't used to do a lot of damage, but then I realized this thing does a crap ton of damage. Oh, I barely dodged. <laughs> yeah. Her, her. Boom! We got another trophy. Do Spatsinism and, uh, uh, Retinizer even have... have masks? I don't know if they do, but... I'll just put them up here. Aren't the twins supposed to fight with each other? I mean, if they're boys, they fight, probably fight with each other. Okay. I'll cut back until it's daytime. Okay, guys, I am back. And, uh, I found these in my chest. And now we're gonna make our melee and ranger set of armor for when we do a one. So when we do want to do melee or ranged, we already have the chest piece. So we do that, and we do that. We don't need this ranged armor anymore. We can just sell that. But I'm not going to. I'll just put it. Uh, <coughs> I'll just put it in her chest. You guys, if you want to find it, uh, where is it? Okay, right there. If you guys want to find it? It's in this chest inside the wood house. And okay, right now this thing does one to oh two. Now it does one twelve. Also, I'm gonna grab all my money. Switch my discard card. Reforge. 36. Okay. Godly, yes! I mean, it's not legendary, but I'm not gonna waste any more gold on that. Okay, and before the end of this episode, we are going to fight Duke Fisher on one more time and go chlorophyte mining. Should we try... Hmm. 
Now nah, we're gonna do mage. Lightning <laughs> What I'm trying to get is the best melee weapon in the game right now. Until the 1.3, of course. Because he drops a weapon that bubbles hurt a lot. His bubbles hurt a lot, so he drops a weapon that hurt. That makes his kind hurt a lot. By his kind, I mean uh, monsters. But he didn't get hurt once yet. Probably because I'm less cautious. Yes, he dropped it first try. He dropped it first try. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. Flare on first try, guys. Flare on first try. And now all we need to get is the wings. How? That was only... Okay, uh, guys, uh, let's fight him again. I want to try and get the mask and the trophy. Only, guys, this time I will speed run it. So, hopefully it's not too long for you guys. That way we can go chlorophyte mining, which I'm also going to research, which I'm also... I can try the flare on on this guy. Oh my gosh, that does a ton of damage. Even when it's not, a, even when it's under 100 health. I mean, it just blows past his defenses. I mean, this thing makes Duke Fisheron look like he has, like he has no armor at all. I'm probably not gonna speed around this part until he gets a sec, until uh, his second thing, which is now. So, say hi guys, see you after the thing. Okay guys, I'm back after that battle. Disappear now. Disappear now. Okay. Guys, we're just gonna, I'm gonna speed run through these next four things. So yeah, see you guys next time in the jungle. See you guys in the jungle, bye.
guys, we got the Duke Fisher on mask and trophy. I think. <gasps> okay, I knew I said I was gonna cut until we got to the jungle after we fought him, but we don't need to fight this guy anymore. Okay. Yermer, if you ever watch this video, I suggest you try fighting the Duke Fisheron with, uh, you know, the, with the Mega Shark and Palidium Armor. It's probably an easy challenge for you, but if I can do it. You probably can do it. Okay guys, now uh, let's go to my potions chest. We'll grab... I didn't say I wanted to go into your shop though. I think I have it something. I'll stick a shine. I already have a shine. Whatever. Okay, and now we will go. Oh yeah, and we also need to catch a fish there. Whatever. Where's some chlorophyte? There's some chlorophyte. arena or enough health I couldn't beat her okay how much chlorophyte did we get guys I'll cut until I mine some more chlorophyte okay guys I'm back chlorophyte mining I have been mining this whole time it took me forever but I'm in mining okay while well, I was mining I managed to get 330 chlorophyte ore mm -hmm, that's pretty good 
managed to get nine life fruit. Four fifty health, that's pretty good. Okay. And now uh basically when you mine chlor fight you need to go to your titanium or adamantite forge and craft a bazillion bars. Okay, we need a fifty-five. Okay, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. That's actually the amount we need. Wait, no, we actually need a little more. We'll get that later though. Now, let me see if there's any... Any of those Plantera bulbs anywhere. I thought I saw another one. Okay, where's another Plantera bulb? Well, I guess since we can't do that, we'll just fight these at the same time. That's because we can. You guys have it. In the next video, we're going to be fighting Plantera, and uh, we're also going to be getting the best melee armor in the game. And yes, I'll do more chlorophyte mining off camera, so you guys don't have to be bored and watch the whole time. Okay, so see you guys in the next video. Bye.